on. I have Kitty Yanko here with me from the Peoria Humane Society. The look that this jo dog just gave me, you were so cute. <laughs> Who do we have? This is Tan Du. Tan Du. Yeah, it's a different name, but he was actually found as a stray, and so for whatever reason, that's what this shelter named him. So I said that he looks like a husky mix. You guys are calling him a shepherd mix. Yeah. Uh, either way, he's got long legs, a bushy tail, and I'm sure he wants to run everywhere. Super handsome, but I will say his personality is really calm, just like this. He gets excited to see people, and he's doing great with other dogs, but he also knows how to chill. So he was found as a stray. Approximately how old? We think he's only a little over a year, so he's young. Oh, and he likes chin scratches. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a good boy. All right, so since we do have a dog, we do have Bark in the Park coming up. And one of the features of Bark in the Park is the marvelous Mutt Show. Yeah, it's always the biggest draw. People get to show up with their dogs and enter into various different categories. And, you know, it's the usual fun stuff like owner, dog lookalike. That's one of my favorites. We have best trick, best costume, which is another big draw. And then we have fastest tail wagger and longest ears. Yes, uh, the longest ears one. Uh, mm -hmm. Last year when I was there, the longest one was like seven, seven and a half inches for the oh, longest wow. ear. So that's pretty long. Oh, we got your attention apparently. Well, hopefully, you know, Yandu gets adopted in time to actually be featured in the Mutt <laughs> Show. Wouldn't That'd that be, be nice. fun? Yeah, he's handsome. He is a very handsome boy. He's not very old. Uh, since he isn't very old, if he isn't up to date on shots, he will be by the time he is adopted. So the shelter provides the first set of basic shots. The rabies shot is up to the owner. Um, they do get microchipped and of course they get spayed and neutered. So most of what is initially needed is done before they leave PCAPs. So he will be ready to go either way. Mm -hmm. He's a very, very happy boy, very handsome too. So let's see if we can get Tondu adopted before Bark in the Park so that he can actually come and hang out at Bark in the Park and participate in the marvelous Mutt Show. Bark in the Park is coming up on September 30th at Tower Park. If you would like to adopt Yondu or any of the other animals, you can contact the number on your screen, 672-2440, and you can get more information on ciproud.com.